everybody. Now I'm gonna teach you how to solve by taking square roots when it equals a perfect square. Looking at the first example, it says x plus three squared equals 49. The first thing you wanna do is to get rid of that squared. So you'll have to take the square root of both sides. And then the square root of 49 equals plus or minus seven. So what that means is that it equals a positive seven and it also equals a negative seven. So what you're now gonna do is separate them into two equations where you have x plus three equals that positive seven and x plus three where it equals the negative seven. Now you're gonna solve the equation. In order to get x by itself, I'm gonna to have to subtract three on both sides. Seven minus three will equal four. And in the second equation, I'm still gonna to have to subtract three on both sides, but negative seven minus three equals negative 10. And that's it. Let's look at this second example. Like I said before, in order to get rid of the square, squared, you have to take the square root of both sides. So then you'll have x minus eight, and the square root of one is plus or minus one. So then my two separate equations will be x minus eight equals one, and x minus eight equals negative one. So then I'm gonna add eight to both sides, and then I'll have x equals nine, because one plus eight is nine, I'm still gonna add eight to both sides, and negative one plus eight equals seven. And these are my two solutions. That's it!